go. Okay, so what are your guys' names? My name is Dean Carmona. I'm Marlene Zamora. Okay, and you guys are from what part of uh, Los Angeles? Where are you guys from? East Los. Okay. Well, I'm not from L.A., but I'm from Arkansas, but I lived in L.A. for a good year and a half. Arkansas? Yeah. Wow, what brought the move from Arkansas? That's a big... Um, opportunities. Okay. Yep. Okay. So, this would be interesting to ask you, what are the biggest differences between life here versus Arkansas? Because Arkansas is the Midwest. Uh, I would say Southern um, hospitality. Okay. I'm used to people saying hi, hello, good morning, and... Oh, yeah. Welcome. People here don't do that at all. They just kind of keep to themselves at all costs. Right. Sometimes yes. even dirty looks. <laughs> yeah. Really? Yeah. Dirty looks is like a huge like thing as well. you your dog and next thing you know, you know. You, you know what's funny? There was a lady one time and all I said was she had a poodle. And this poodle had like this decked out haircut. Mm -hmm. And all I said was, how? You, your dog's haircut is really nice. She's like, I didn't ask you. I'm like. <gasps> what? Disrespectful. I, was like, well, I'm, I'm, I said I'm not it's even trying to get at you. I'm talking Very about disrespectful. Yeah. Chill. So it's too much, man. So yeah. what are and then you you've been in LA your whole life? What's your name? Um, I've been in LA. I mean, live in Fontana now, but my name's Marlene. Marlene. Um, but I've stayed here for a couple years, and like I'll just say, like the traffic is not it. Neither the parking. Really. Yeah. Traffic and parking are bad. Yeah, traffic it's and very like it's really always. Bad. There's always crashes on, like, you mentioned earlier, like, the crashes can go from, like, 20 minutes to three hours, you know? So it's and it's like, more than one crash Crash at that. It's, like, two or three. <laughs> yeah, it's chaotic. <laughs> it's very chaotic here. What are, what are uh, okay, so what are some of the best things that you like about Los Angeles? What are some of the things, like, I really like? Um, I would say the beaches. The beaches? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Um, Santa Monica Beach. Um, Laguna. Laguna. Laguna Beach. Um, the beaches in Malibu is really nice as well. That's yeah. where I tend to go to. Okay, that's fair. Um, if you go to Newport, be careful with the trash. <laughs> <laughs> that's all I gotta say. Newport Beach. <laughs> Newport Beach? You gotta yeah. watch out for the trash. Yeah. Really? Newport's not... Is Newport trash? I haven't been Yeah, I, I walked around like literally last week and there was like a bunch of trash like chips bottles you know really? and i was like dang if you're gonna make a mess like clean it up you know yeah, yeah but laguna low-key is good and venice and like he said malibu is pretty good yeah okay. i have yet to set foot on a bit beach at all so really yeah i don't go to there if it's not good i don't go and if you don't <laughs> like the smell of fish newport smells a lot like fish because they have a shop there that's just like dedicated to selling fish so mm -hmm. yeah Really? Mm -hmm. Yeah. That is very interesting. I haven't been to Newport in a while. Yeah, there's the last people time I went, who it was go. very clean. Really? That was like 10 years ago. Uh, oh, no. that, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, there's people like, yeah, they create a mess if not. And then in the mornings, like, I like to go to the beach at night. Okay. So, like, in the morning, sometimes I stay for sunrise or whatever. Oh, yeah, sunrises are pretty. Yeah, so when I'm here, like, dark times, like, around 6 a.m. or something, okay. there's people who go out and fish and catch the fish fresh, and, like, people go and shop for the, not, like, the fresh fish, you know? Uh -huh. But, like, the smell, though. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Smell it's near funky. the pier. <laughs> How do you feel about, like, the cost of stuff? Because, I mean, I'm from L.A., and I, I have a small business. I feel like that stuff here It's pretty expensive. So expensive huh? It's expensive. Like, if you're going to come here, you better make sure you save up. <laughs> Yeah, because it's very pricey here. Yeah. How do you feel? Because being from Arkansas to here, oh, yeah. like Coster, like what would you feel? As <laughs> Let me tell you something. <laughs> I had to work my ASS off okay. <laughs> to make the living that I have now. Okay. Um, it is not easy living here in L.A. Okay. So if you are coming here thinking that you're going to succeed and become an influencer or be, so become some big thing, think again. Um, yeah. a, uh, a very few, like, select uh, people get selected, and that's only the people that's, like, Stop. that know people, that know people, that know people, yeah, that get selected for that. You don't have to be talented to be selected. You just have to know someone, to be to be honest. I think that's really wise because yeah, a lot of people, like, I'll meet a lot of ladies, like, I want to be a model. I'm like, don't even know. I get you're fine. Yeah. Like, do you know how many pretty people are here that want to be models? And yeah. Bro, like, I who seen, do you know to get you into that you world? You have to have connections. Connections. Do you have to do to even be in that world? Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. I get that all the time. People be like, oh, you should be a model. You should be a model. You should be a model. And I'm just like, yeah, I probably should. But at the at the 
same time, I don't know anyone. So, do you have any connections? <laughs> like, <laughs> hook me up. Instead of, yeah, yeah, instead of saying you should be something, give me someone's phone number, you know, someone I can text or, you know, so I can become a model, you know. <laughs> you, you, have a, you have an Instagram? I do have an Instagram. Instagram I'll put it in the okay, Instagram. my Instagram is Dean Carmona, or you can go, uh, I go by Phantom Black as well. Black. That's my stage name. That's a cool name. Yeah. Black? Yeah, oh, Phantom. Uh, isn't that a Rolls Royce Phantom Black? <laughs> yep. Yeah, it is. It is. It is. <laughs> I don't have no Rolls Royce, but I was like... I love the name Phantom Black. It just rings bells for me. Beautiful. Yeah. Mine's so basic. How much different... Okay, because you were in Arkansas a year and a half ago, you said? I said it again. You were in Arkansas like a year and a half ago? Yes. So how much is like... Okay, I was in the Midwest for a while, and like, yeah. you can rent... A three bed, two bath, nice house for like a thousand dollars a month. Over yeah. Here, that same pad is gonna cost you five to seven grand. Uh, very much so. Is it the same in Arkansas? Like things are just way. Yes. Um, the living in Arkansas is very cheap. And then when I came over here, I noticed that I was having to pay more and get less. And I'm not used to that. Even when I lived in Texas, I was used to paying less and getting more in LA or in Cal California in, in, in general, like you're going to get less. It doesn't matter how much you make, you're going to get less. Unless you're making billions, you're getting less. You know, it's funny because I own a business and I, I, talk, I do okay, but even I'm like, bro, like, like you would think, oh, you have a business. No, it's like by the time you factor in your cost. Yeah. It's just, it's really expensive. It takes time to build. It right does. Here. It takes years to build. I think you nailed it, saying it takes years. You're not going to come here and in a year you're just going to be that. Mm -hmm. this established. Mm -hmm. It doesn't work that way. And that's why I feel like a lot of people come to L.A. and they be like, they oh, I hate, oh I hate I hate L.A., da, da, da. I met these people. I met these type of people. And I'm like, <laughs> you came here with the wrong type of mindset. Like. You can't come here thinking that you're going to be the greatest thing on earth because you're not. I'm just letting you know. <laughs> I'm just letting you know. Thinking you're the greatest thing in life. No, but you know, it is about being humble because, you know, many times I've met people where they really, like I had a lady, she was a famous model in her country. Mm -hmm. and I actually met her uh, here. And I, I said, hey, I know someone hiring for this. Like, no, I don't do that kind of work. I'm above. I'm like, mm. you're big in your country, but here nobody knows you. Yeah. You have to start from the bottom country, up. But you're not Things in your are country. different. Yeah. Everywhere. Like yeah. I said before, it's about who you know. Like, you might be big in your country, but, like, <laughs> no one in your nobody country knows you. anyone here. Like. LA is like the center point for, and New York is like the center point for like modeling. Like Milan, Italy, Italy I yeah. Mean Hollywood, like people just trying to be famous. At yeah. That point, you know, and they're just like feeding for it instead of like thinking about actually what working actually, for it. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They, yeah, they yeah, think they're entitled to it just because they're pretty. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I had, I had a girlfriend years ago, and I'll never forget. She told me something once. She was really, really pretty Russian, and I remember she told me something. Mm -hmm. She's like, I deserve it because I'm beautiful. And I was like, Girl. Oh, girl. girl. Yeah. In my mind, I was like, at that moment, I knew. Yeah. As, as quickly and oh. peacefully as possible. You got to go. That's how she feels. That's not going to work. Yeah. No, well, the thing is, eventually we are going to get ugly. Let's be realistic. Yeah. yeah we're I, know, <laughs> I know I'm going to fade. <laughs> so I, I'm just, I I'm just waiting. Gonna fade down. <laughs> I know it's going gonna, it's gonna to come. I'm just waiting. So <laughs> I'm 26. I'm 21. Yeah. Oh, you guys I'm going to turn 22. Oh, you're young. Yeah. yeah. Young. So what were you guys doing? I, I mean, so let the audience know because I like filming at night. It's like 3 in the morning. <laughs> So, chilling, talking okay. about our lives at the beach, listening to the waves. Yeah, we. Um, I have recently moved to New York, okay. and I flew back to LA to go to a concert and to catch up with my friend here. Okay. And um, this is also so. Bad guys. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say, like, yeah, that's bad. I got so scared for the cameras. I was like, it better not. Yeah. Is it good? Yeah. Okay. So I'm just here visiting. Um, New York now. Yeah, I'm in New York right now, and it's okay. very expensive there. Yeah, I was just in New York, <laughs> and I was like, bro. 
it's too much. Forty bucks just to park at the hotel. Like, oh my god! Don't it's... I pay for the hotel now? I gotta spend forty to park. I didn't. And know. it's like I'm not gonna drive three miles away and walk. Yeah. And the Uber's like twenty five. I'm like. Ah, uh, you don't. We don't want to talk about the Ubers yeah. in New York. <laughs> no, we don't want to do that. I'm like I haven't gone so. <laughs> well, she, you, you're gonna come visit me soon in New York. So. Okay. Um. I'm just here catching up with my friend. We went to a concert earlier tonight, and so we decided to go to the beach because I rented an uh, Airbnb nearby. Oh, cool. And so um, we just wanted to catch up on the beach and just talk about like life. What we've been up to, you know? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's cool. Beautiful. So your names again one more time? So I'm Dean Carmona. And I'm Marlene Zamora. You guys have like a, it sounds like a very, you guys have like a, it sounds like a very expensive fashion line. <laughs> like your name sounds like stuff I could never afford. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like stuff like, oh, it's like, oh, it's Carmona. Well, I know. Right. <laughs> on Rodeo Drive. Well, thank you guys so much for sharing. So if anyone were to come to visit LA, what parts would you, let's say someone wants to come visit, what part would you say come visit? Laguna Beach. <laughs> Laguna um, Beach. Laguna Beach, and I would say Point Doom and Malibu. Okay. Um, but Point also, Doom. I will visit any type of national park you can oh, it's national. very 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 beautiful here yeah. um what? underrated because a lot of people don't think about that they yeah and they're like let me hit the okay. with tours yeah they want to go to rodea park. drive no, echo park <laughs> yeah echo, echo park. park yeah like yeah before it used to be pretty they have swan boats and stuff but like now there's a lot of like Trash. Like trash really? and homeless around there. I haven't been to Echo Park in like two years. It was nice. It's got yeah, work. but there there's been homeless people around there too, and it's like oh, like it's like okay if they're chilling, whatever you know. But it's, sometimes it's like some weirdos <laughs> that try to talk to you and stuff, and then you'll be like, <laughs> you, you want to hear? A, here's a funny story. So I was getting some camera stuff for this camera, and I was leaving Best Buy, and this guy comes up to me. And I'm not rich, but if someone needs a couple extra bucks, whatever. Yeah. So he's like, yeah, bro, I'm just trying to get a bite to eat. And I'm like, look, I'm going to this, uh, it was a hamburger french fry spot. I was like, if you want, you can meet me there. I'll literally going to be there in like 10 minutes. Yeah. yeah. So I was waiting. He actually showed up. So I'm Aww. like, what do you want? He's like, I just want like a chicken sandwich. I'm like, okay. Uh, it was like 10 bucks. I'm like, okay, I, I can, I got you. Yeah. So he's like, hey, thanks, man. So we're eating. So as we're eating, this girl walks up to the door. Mm -hmm. and he's like, hey, mom, let, let me holler at you real quick. Like being like super like out there. I'm like. And then she's like, uh, she ignores it, like, yeah, F you, mother F, just starts chewing. I was like, okay, this is why you're at where you're at. Yeah. Now yeah. it makes sense. Yeah. And he's like, yeah, these, these females, they be hating. I'm like, bro, you, know like, what? you look like you haven't bathed in weeks. <laughs> yeah. Like, I'm buying you food, and then you, you're mad. You want to act wanna like that? You. And I just started thinking, yeah, I got to go. He's like, hey, you don't want to chill? I'm like, I got to get going, bro. Yeah. yeah. Like, I got to go. Yeah. But yeah, very, very like entitled and creepy and i'm thinking no like there's people who've came up to me and they genuinely simply ask for food or like a couple bucks and i'm like yeah like i got you you know sure, sure, but yeah. then there's people who approach you in a way that's like aggressive they, in a way a not a get at me sometimes but okay. yeah that too but sometimes it's like they can be a little like aggressive like weird like what are you doing like what are you up to tonight and i'm like get away you know <laughs> like, i'm like i'm trying to go home you know but, yeah. yeah. Damn myself. So it, but LA has Echo a big Park. homeless problem, doesn't it? It's it's very big. big. Don't realize. There's a lot of homeless. There's a very lot. Homeless. Like you drive out the freeways, literally under the freeway bridges or some, you see There's people. Like yes, and I'm just like, dang, you know, like tough, but. Yeah, there's like quite a few here in, in Santa Monica as well. Yeah, as I was walking here before I ran into you guys, I must have called them about the rest. <laughs> 10 to 12 homeless people here in the... Right. You yeah. know what? I'm, I'm gonna be straight up. Right now that we were walking down this pier... <laughs> what happened? What'd you guys do? There was a lot of rats! I was like, three, of, okay, that was so, three to four rats in, just... In right? Earlier, in the earlier video, I thought it was... I thought it was a squirrel, but I was like, squirrels don't be chilling at this time of night. No, no it was. There was, was like it was three a or four bunch, rats. like five. And me and him were like, ah. okay, okay. We started running. It wasn't just one. I was like, either this rat is really fast, or there's a community of them. It's a community. No, it's a lot. It's, we were over here like, oh no, let's go. <laughs> it's the mother, the father, the auntie, the <laughs> uncle, the Every, niece, the, whole family. the nephew, the grandma, and the grandpa. <laughs> oh, they just all is. running around here. Beautiful. Well, thank you guys so much for sharing your <laughs> yeah. experiences of LA. And I have to ask, let me see your nails. Oh, the nails are very stylish. Look at the nails. Who, who, who did them for you? My friend, actually. Yeah. Very stylish. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Is your friend a professional? Um, She's starting. Yeah, those are really good. It, I worked with um, this Colombian lady for uh -huh. a long time. 
And so now I always notice like fashionable stuff. So I was like, uh, the makeup and the nails, like, oh, thank you. Very, very sharp. Well, thank you guys so much. I appreciate it. You're welcome. Okay.